Well, we are just hours away from the big moment for the brand new 6th Street Viaduct. Yeah, people excited about this. After years of construction, the bridge will finally connect historic Royal Heights with the downtown arts district. CBS 2's Tina Patel is getting a first-hand look. How does it look out there, Tina? It looks so cool behind you. Yeah, and it's really cool to be on a bridge that you know in a, a few days people are going to be driving. You're not going to be able to be on it. Official grand opening today. Then there's going to be celebrations all weekend and the bridge officially opening to traffic Sunday night. Take a look at this beauty that we've been watching being constructed. Such a gorgeous backdrop with the city uh, skyline behind it. Now, this is a 3,500 foot bridge. It costs $588 million. It is actually the largest bridge project in the history of the city. The new design features 20 sweeping arches that frame the downtown LA skyline. Architects wanted to pay homage to the original 1932 bridge that had to be demolished because it was seismically deficient. Now, as we said, this bridge is going to connect Boyle Heights with the Arts District downtown, but the architect tells us he hopes people don't just see it as functional. The vision of the bridge was to make a structure that went beyond simply taking cars from one side to the other. Families used to pile into their cars and, and just go for a drive to see the city. I think the Sixth Street Bridge is, is going to be a part of that kind of itinerary. And you can drive across the bridge starting Sunday night, but there's also bike lanes and pedestrian walkways. So if you want to take in the view that way, you can. And even though the main part is done, there are still plans to construct a 12 acre park underneath the bridge with recreation areas, access to the LA River. So a really big project that is finally at this point that we can all enjoy it. Amy and Chris will send it back to you.